I guess for me, I write a lot of songs about you know just life experience, whether it be relationships or um, you know just a, a viewpoint on you know something that I want to know about, something that I do know about, that I want to tell someone about. You know what I mean? Just okay. just life experience. Do you write about specific people? Does that get weird? Um. I have written about some specific people. Okay. I wrote a song. Don't know, right? Well, um, for instance, on my record that's coming up, I did write like a. a this is your first record. Right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it, the other stuff, the other music that I've recorded has never been released. So, this okay. this is technically my debut album. Um, like I wrote a song for uh, my wife on this on this upcoming record, and we actually had Jimmy Haskell do strings for it, write the string chart. He did the string charts, a lot of string charts for the Beatles. You know, I write songs. I wrote I wrote one song, you know, from like about from another person's pers or from my perspective of another person. Okay. Written songs about you know bad relationships, good relationships. So pretty much, you don't have any limits. You just kind of yeah. Write different well, stuff. the only limit is well, I write what I know. Right. Kind of like okay. what I would apply to screenwriting is what I apply to writing music. Okay, so you use like it's not you don't separate the two. It's like a, you use the same. Yeah, I mean I just well of thought. you know the the pattern of thought for writing scripts is write what you know. <laughs> and I mean, music can transcend that, but for me, it, it, it feels the same. Okay. What, if you could tell people one thing about what your ambitions are with this and where you're going to go and where you're headed. And well, with music, I really just enjoy playing and sharing the songs that I've written. So, my goal would be to be able to afford to do that with a band. Um, and that's sort of why I'm doing the acoustic tour. You know, to kind of introduce my material and see if people are into it. Okay. If it, even if it means I have to give away an Epiphone acoustic guitar at the end of it, just to get people to like to. log onto my website. No, but it's 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 really like I would just love to be able to have it kind of pay for itself. Okay. I'm not looking to you know become a rock star, but you know if I could get on like a tour, like opening for a band or something, okay. that would be a lot of fun. How many cities have you played so far? Um, I've played Los Angeles, Chicago, New York, uh, Philadelphia, Pittsburgh, Austin, Texas, and that's it so far. But I've done like multiple dates in all those cities, so I think I'm like 24. Uh, this is my 20. This gig that I played tonight was my 24th show on the acoustic tour. And, and how many shows do you have all together? Well. I'm still booking them. I'm gonna take it all the way through the end of the year, I think, or at least until the album is released, or you know. What's, what's like the that. title of the album? Oh, uh, it's called "Without Warning." Okay. Is that the title of the track? The, yeah, it's okay. one of the tracks, and they use it for the. Which album you played on the attention. Yeah. <laughs>
your mind. 